Mason was asked, is this an upset? What do you think? I don't think it's an upset. Um, you know, I feel I'm very confident as a football team. We've done the right things. You know, it's three years into our culture. Uh, you know, you got to give our players a lot of credit for their buy-in and our coaches and building those relationships. And, uh, you know, we felt like um, it was going to be a challenging game. Anytime you go on the road uh, in this SEC and uh, play an opponent like Arkansas, it's going to be very challenging. But I truly and we truly did feel like we had the best team. Um, but. Uh, you know, that doesn't matter. Uh, you still got to come in and execute and uh, make sure you're, you play at a high level in all three phases. And um, you got to continue to reset and refocus and, and prepare the right way. But uh, I thought our team, uh, you know, handled everything very well today and, and played hard. I, I mean, know you can't like speak to what happened before you were here, but in the past, North Texas has been in a handful of these games, but never been able to pull it out. It seemed like, you know, wear down in the fourth quarter. You were able to keep pouring it on. Why was. Why were you able to do that in the fourth quarter and second half? Again, I just think the way we're building. I think Coach Womack does a great job with our guys. Um, you know, they're very well prepared. They're in shape. Uh, and I feel like we have much more depth as well, you know, through, uh, you know, continuing to go out and recruit, build, develop guys. Um, you know, our depth's a lot better than, it, than it's been since I've been here. And so uh, you don't get as wore down. Uh, but uh, again, uh, I think we're uh, building ourselves into uh, be a very, very deep physical football team. And we just got to continue to reset. And, to prepare the right way. How big people, is this win for your program? Excuse me. How big is this win for your program? I, I think that it's it's a huge win, and um, you know, anytime you can uh, one start out three and zero, you know, build up momentum coming and playing against a SEC opponent on the road. Uh, those are huge wins, and those are uh, those are program changers to where it builds confidence, and allows you to continue to grow and develop, and. Know, continue that momentum down the road. So, uh, you know, our guys were very confident. We've been in games, uh, you know, last year. We've been on the road with some big time games. We've played in championships. We've played in bowl games. And I think uh, the more experiences you get, the more comfortable you get. I think our guys, again, were confident coming in today, and it's, it's a big win for them. What did you see from your defense, just the energy they were able to sustain throughout the entire game? Yeah, and that's something that uh, they've, they've really practiced extremely well, and it's something that. Coach Ref, the defense, all those coaches have done a great job of coaching. The players have done a great job of listening and understanding what we have to do to, uh, in order for us to, to win football games. And that's what they did. They came out here and they dominated uh, defensively. And they're a huge reason why uh, we won that game. Uh, you know, I, I felt like special teams also was tremendous today, you know, hitting that huge uh, power darn for a touchdown. I thought our punt team did a great job of pinning them down and they had poor uh, field position all night, forced them to have to drive the entire field. Um, you know, offensively, we were just a little bit inconsistent. Uh, but overall, you got to give them some credit as well. They're big and physical. But you got to win two out of the three phases. And I felt like uh, we dominated two out of the three phases, which uh, allowed us to win that football game. What to say about your offense when you're saying that they didn't have their best day, but they put 44 points on the road? SEC we didn't put up 44 points. Defense put up some of those points. Special teams put up some of those points. And so overall, it's a, it's a team. And I don't care if we win by one or uh, 50. It doesn't, you know, at the end of the day, a win's a win. Um, you know, but we understand that's not our standards of how we play offensively. And uh, we have we have higher standards and higher goals uh, each and every week. But again, uh, I promise you this, uh, it will. they'll come back. They'll come back even hungrier this week and continue to work and get better. And, um, you know, we don't have it all figured out offensively either. Again, we got to continue to grow and get better each and every week. Your reaction, your reaction, your reaction and, no, just to keep the, the, the return, your reaction, your excitement about the, the It's awesome return. to see something work that you've prepared for, Marty. You know, um, you know, having, uh, uh, getting the right play and working it all week. And like I told Brew, it takes a lot of guts for someone to stand back there and, and, and do that. And our team, uh, you know, when something like that, just like Mason said, you know, some of the guys are like, wow, I mean, everybody's wanting to see if this thing really works. And, uh, for it to pay off like that, it only juices your team up even more. It gets them excited. Uh, they were so happy to see uh, that return. And, uh, I was too. It was it was it was fun fun to watch. That's for sure. I got to be a fan on that play as well. How hard did he have to sell it to you? Though? Not hard. Uh, we're going to play aggressive and we're going to be aggressive. And uh, you know I, you know I, I believe that uh, you know as coaches you got to try to put your guys in great situations to be successful. They're not all going to work. Uh, we. we, we we have some bad calls at times. We, we put in bad plays at times. But if you're not willing to try them, then what is going to work? Talk about the way Cole came through in the back here where he kicked before. Proud of Cole. Um, 
no, he was uh, he was focused all week long. You know, I, I, again, first time I even thought about it was last week when you said something in the press conference, and uh, we never talked about it throughout the week. I knew uh, his teammates have a lot of confidence in him. He's really growing. Uh, he's prepared very well each and every week and through the off season in order to put himself in position to make those plays. And uh, just goes to show you when you have. Uh, you know, the confidence of your teammates, the confidence of your, your, your coaches. Uh, when you work extremely hard, uh, you, usually your confidence comes up a little bit and you're able to make those kicks. Mason, really played well. This is kind of a homecoming for him. Were you proud of the way he continued to really go for you guys? Mason's phenomenal. Uh, he always, he's business. Uh, he, he prepares the right way, prepares like a pro. And uh, there's never a doubt in my mind that uh, he's always ready to play. A couple more guys. We good? Yeah, thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you.